September 23rd we're all in the midst of fall now all right you guys here's what we've got Portugal this is a mm -hmm. when was this 2020 is when it was made gosh it seems longer since we've had this anyway here it is retired all its beauty it's like such a lovely raspberry color to me I adore it no holding black. Black. I haven't got to use it yet. So here I am. Sweet, sweet baby. You guys don't know how many emails I sent telling them we needed a black and silver glitter dip. Thank you, Fa. About time. No. <laughs> That's a backwards or a backhanded compliment, right? Thank you. About time. Okay, this is the Sally Hansen 2013. It's called Check It Out. And it's got the houndstooth print. Black and white houndstooth print. So, alright you guys. Now, my title for this, if you can't beat them, join them. <laughs> I know you guys have seen the nail fee. Everybody has done it. When that new green set came out, it was like... Probably the first, one of the first nail fees i seen from people. Um, and, and I would guess it was probably because it was a good way to, like, I don't want to say highlight. Um, well, highlight maybe is the right word. It was the best way probably to highlight No Holding Black and show how to use it. Because I know at first, like, people were either, like, oh my gosh, a black glitter dip, I'm sold. Or they were like, what? A black glitter dip? Like, why do we want that? I'm in the camp of yes, yes, yes. <laughs> but I know not everybody was. So anyway, um, everybody or a lot of people, a lot of people, you guys, used um, Stay in Check, which is the new green check with some Midnight in Manhattan or Only in Vegas or, you know, whatever um, black accent, I guess. And then um, No Holding Black as like an accent also. And, um, and then uh, Tina, if you watch Tina, her link to her page is out on my front of my page. Um, she used, uh, oh crap, the suit one, the like blue duochrome, anyway, she used that one, um, and then I had these paired up, the, the houndstooth in Portugal paired up, and I was like, wait, I gotta add something, so I thought if I added this, I get to jump in on this little trend people are doing um but in a diff little bit different style so i've got my orly bonder down and you guys know i am not one to jump in on the the trendy stuff like i figure if everybody else is doing it you guys are seeing seeing it right like you're seeing how to do it you're seeing it out there you don't need me to tell you how to do it because you're getting it everywhere else um, so I try to do things that are, um, maybe something that's past because if you have done color street long, you guys, do you notice how fast the trends go in, out, in, out, like so quick, like it'll be, well, literally right now, nobody gives two craps about glazed donuts again. Like it just is so quick that the trends are in and out. So, um. You know, I try not to work with them, but when I find one that I like, then I try to remind you guys of it and not necessarily bring it back. But at least, you know, maybe somebody was like, oh, that's right, I was going to try that and then I never did or 
you know, whatever, whatever the reason was. Um, and also, here's what happens. Like, all the new sets come out and I'm like, wait, I haven't even got to finish using what I had. So I just try to keep chipping away, like, maybe it took me three years to get to doing something, but I've gotten to it. Maybe you're somebody new, and now you've been inspired by something, like, that you never seen because it hasn't been around for, you know, people haven't been doing it for years. So, you know, I just try to, try to not focus so much on the trends, um, and just try to focus on, hopefully, something you guys will like, but not only just that. Um, something that you can do. Hmm. You know, a good mix of like, what's a little trickier? What's not a little trickier? Or maybe something looks tricky, but is not tricky. That's even better. If I can break it down for you to the point where you can do it, I am excited. That's like, definitely my goal. Oh my gosh, you guys. I adore Portugal. I would love when when they did um Raspberry Remix. I thought it was going to be like this. It wasn't, by the way. <laughs> at all. <laughs> Not at all. <coughs> so, anyway, here we are. Using one of my all-time favorite colors. When it comes to the pinks, I'm a little bit like I am with my blues. Like, I like them to be a little off. Like, not just the standard. Not just the standard pink or standard blue. Although I do think, looking at this, does this pink have a little blue to it? Is that why it's... Is that why I like it? I don't know. I do know that right now... Ray this, Ray this stinking minute. This nail is the best shape ever and it's at such a lovely length, but I can never keep it. I can never keep them that way. I don't know. I did do a bunch of cuticle work though, you guys. That's why my cuticles are a little rough looking right now. Well, not rough, but they look dry because I did push them back like crazy um isn't that hound's tooth fun this is one that marie brought me a silly hansen that marie brought me and she actually brought me two kinds that are like the same except one has a smaller hound's tooth print on it suit yourself that's the set tina used dang it i knew i would get it and it was, it was gorgeous. I mean, duochrome, let's go. Let's duochrome it, you guys. Let's duochrome everything. Yeah, so the other one she brought is a teenier print. Could have used that too for some reason. I was feeling this bigger print I was in it. And these for 2013, meaning they're nine years old, they're going on beautifully. They're lovely. I like this hound's tooth print. Makes makes me happy. Let me see if I can. Edges are cleaning up nice. It's going on good. Oh, that's beautiful. These two are so lovely together. Hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> Willow and I had to run some errands today and her and Ethan and I have a group chat thread on um, Facebook Messenger. So I send them like a cat meme every day and you know just random whatever's in there. Pick up this, pick up that. We're gone, we're home, that type of deal. Um, so I sent her a message last night and said, We gotta run into town for daddy. Make sure you got your shacket ready. <laughs> she did say it was funny. And we did. We ran our errands, but you did not need a shacket. It was muggy out today. It's been muggy out lately because it's been raining a lot. Is the season. You know, and I gotta clean that teeny little bit there. You know, it's such a fine line, like, ooh, I wanna clean this up a little, but also don't wanna mess up my whole damn beautifulness. Oh, you're gorgeous. I think I've been liking to flatten this hair. Just a little. There's a mosquito in here making me bonkers, you guys. He said, I gotta come in because it's now warmer inside than outside. Because in the evening, it's chilling out beautifully. I'm not super worried about these, you guys, because I am going to use no holding black, but still. Oh my gosh. That's gorgeous. Alright. Okay, so I kind of want... Well, let me get my thumbs done because... Really, all I've got left to do is um, overlays. I would like to I would like to mix it up a little. Like I want to do, um, you know, one where the the glitter dip comes from the bottom and one where it comes from the top. Give that a go. I don't necessarily know what finger I'm doing what on, but I have three of the no holding blacks out, so there should be plenty. I want to use it on my. Oh dang, I cut too far on that one. I want to use it on my Portugal, but I'd also use like to use it on one of the Highlands. Whoops, not Highlands, sorry. The Color Street version of this, um, A, it was like a, a pearl finish or whatever. Uh, I don't think it was Shimmer. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe it was called Shimmer. Anyway, you know what I mean. Um, that was called Highland Hounds Tooth. This actually if you're looking for it, is called Stay in Check, which is kind of funny to me because, I mean, it's houndstooth, it's not check, but, but I double-checked it. <laughs> check, 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 check. I double-checked it even more than double-checked it online, like in three different places to make sure I was giving you guys the right name in case you wanted to go looking for it. I didn't place that very well. Good thing I'm using a glitter dip. Darn it. Willow has a couple of her favorite water bottles. Like one is just like stainless steel colored. 
and has a screw on top with like, you know, a hole with a little lid type of deal. The other one is white, also like stainless steel style, but it has a straw. And, you know, whenever we're going anywhere in the car, she's refreshing her water bottle before we leave. Um, and so she always has it with her when she goes in for therapy and stuff. And I was laughing because her therapist, Missy, who has really been like her turning point as far as therapists go, she's been fantastic. But um, she got her a vinyl sticker for her water bottle that says emotional support water bottle. <laughs> I was cracking up because it's seriously, it is one of those things like she'll be like, wait, I forgot my water bottle. <laughs> oh, I love it. Okay. There's this one. And now I'm going to cut these with me sharpie scissors first because um you know they got not big chunky glitters chunky glitters aren't good to do with your fingernail because you can just pull them out and make things look like crap what do I think of that I don't know I don't know yet now let's try I'm going to try two things on one hand. This one. Has it coming from the bottom. Let me clean the edges. I can't give an opinion when it's messy edged. I can only give an opinion when I see it nice and clean. Yeah, if you decide you want to do it, um where it's coming from the bottom instead of the dip from the top just cut your strip you know roughly in half dang this mosquito did I get him I did I did get him but now I got mosquito gut mosquito gutted hang on this needs a little nip here Okay, what do we think? I think I like it better going up. Marie and I were just having this conversation because she likes it better coming from the bottom than coming down. Now keep in mind that nail's so short, it's a hard, hard one to judge. We'll have a better judge over here. Because over here we have the opposite thing going on. We've got this one short and that one's long. I know that color is stinking stunning. That's what I do know. And these, if you've not used these glitter dips before, you guys, they're a little bit shorter than the regular nail strips are. Um, so that they give you the, the dip can go in a good place, even if you have a short nail. I like it any better on a longer nail. I do like it better on a longer nail, actually. So this might be one of those things where if it's a shorter nail, I'm going to like it better coming from the bottom. And that's okay. I mean, usually, you guys, 
for the most part, I don't have a sh I don't have shorter nails, so. And I and I do try not to. I try to keep them at least long enough to get a little decoration going on them. So many color street strips, like especially if you're using an ombre, you lose a lot of it with short nails. I want to do it across it, uh, across it on my thumbs because I do like that also. So let's find roughly halfway-ish. Clean it up and see. No, I think maybe if that would have been a different color, but I don't honestly know that I'm gonna love this over Highland no matter which way. Like this time, let's do it where it's coming from the bottom. I just think it has more to do with the fact that, you know, the black kind of is like buggers up the black design. I think that's more what it's, what the problem is for my brain. Let's see. I'll clean it up quick and see. I am glad I gave these a try, though. I do like that better so it's just from the side that I don't like it and it may just be that there's no color contrast like say I used Ken's Betty doing this I think I'd like that better actually could have used Ken's Betty on those highlands and it would have brought the pink in from that edge. I love these though as an overall you guys, I really like them. Here, let me put that out there. Or do this. Yeah. They're super fun. I love them. Thanks, Marie Haskins. I love me some Highland. Nails are looking good, ladies. Once this little guy catches up, it's going to be on like a Donkey Kong. Alright, have a good one, you guys. I'll see you soon.